again, uh, I'm not going to stop going on at Ma Amanda Tapping, uh, seeing as she uh, visited me here down in uh, Dartmouth. Uh, my father was present at uh, the mall we were at, and what came out of her mouth was, you wouldn't hit me, and she couldn't bother uh, finishing for the 20 years of psychological abuse I went through with my family, and the mental abuse. That to me uh, is mean of this TV star. Uh, she did single me out, and she's extremely capable of a hate crime if she's uh, calling me anything. Uh, she possibly may have visited my family's home too, because there was a conversation uh, somebody's having about, uh, and I don't have, uh, I don't have any pantyhose. Well, my ex-wife did, but. That's long gone, but um, mm -hmm. I'm in a pantyhose on women. Yeah, uh, Amanda fucking tapping. So where in the fuck do you get off? Slacking your dumb little bitch jaw to me, ripping me off uh, two million fucking dollars because it was all my father's income tax. I don't give a rat's ass if you don't like this lady. He says you're going to talk to me. You gotta fuck up. You're a coward and you're a goddamn criminal, and you're extremely capable of committing a hate crime. And women can be abusive too, Amanda. Whereas uh, Sally Kent was using the terms cat fucker, Gavin is his name, Scottish fucker. Uh, I've had Greg Wilson uh, hear her say such things. And I don't fucking care if this TV star doesn't bloody well like it. Because if she can't talk to me about what's up her freaking duff. I think that's just pathetic of her. This is a talk with my mother, Amanda. Did you know that? A man of fucking tapping? Did Jill, does Jill St. Marsh have a heavy drinking problem? Well, she doesn't have a fucking cocaine problem. Hey? Okay. You know, dust that off there, lady? Where uh, Dr. Watson uh, told my mother, and this came from my father uh, with a phone conversation. You're not to interfere in your son's medical affairs if Dr. Nicholson got caught across the borders for his gambling problems. And I give a rat's ass if this actress doesn't like it because I got hell from her from singing this song. Shouldn't have. Madden Cabby doesn't have any damn right to tell me what songs to like sing, what shows to like. Uh, what to do, get down on me for my hobby, for my science fiction and fantasy, because I love my science fiction and fantasy, and it's more than just Star Trek and SG-1, it's rather single-minded, and had she not done what she did, uh, I wouldn't be doing this. Allegedly, I ruined a perfectly good song. Uh, I think she's just overly negative of herself, you know, the honest truth. And I'm glad I found the uh, space uh, and put the video and uh, also uh, I 
I got ripped off a large sum of money, and uh, if I can't ever get it back, because it was a settlement, something Sally Kent helped to mention, and also there's some stuff out uh, and about the surgical mesh they used for my hernia repair back in 1996-98 uh, corrective surgery. Then uh, they gave me a pain block, I uh, hit my sciatic. Mm, hasn't been the same. That's why I have trouble walking. I didn't cause my pain and it wasn't my fault. Uh, you people were wrong to get down on me for Sally Kent for my injury, for picking on me about it. You bullied me with your fucking star power like Oprah fucking Winfrey did. Uh, that wasn't cool because I had every right to speak my side and they weren't being fair about it. And uh, <laughs> Oprah Winfrey is among one of the people who's extremely capable of reverse racism, and I will never back down from uh, her about that, ever. Seeing as, uh, oh, that was your father, not me. If you fucking aired yourself, lady, and for what reason? I said I want a damn copy of it. You're a coward and a criminal, for frickin' Wimpery. Harpo Studios. Yeah, you fucking are. Oh, uh, 631, never mind slapping your freaking woman beating freaking hands there, uh, 204, I don't even know what the asshole's name is, but I know his girlfriend name's Kathy, but, uh, you guys a jerk, fuck off, woman beater.